Welcome to Wheel of Arsenal and today we are going to discuss some of the players that has been linked with Arsenal for the coming January transfer window. We all remember the player by the name Ferran Torres who had moved to Barcelona from the Premier League side Manchester City in the last January transfer season. Since his move to La Liga Giants, he has not hit the heights of what was expected of him. Various Spanish outlets claim that the Barcelona manager Xavi has lost interest in the former Man City player. Arsenal and Arteta are looking into this player, especially since we have lost Gabriel Jesus for a long-term injury. If we are in a spot of bother due to the injury of Gabriel Jesus, we would need to bring in a player who could play in his position. Ferran Torres is a versatile player who could play as a number 9 or as an attacking winger. So when the Brazilian number 9 returns from injury, we could play Ferran Torres on either wings to help out Martinelli and Bakayo Saka. Arteta knows the Barcelona player from his Man City days and he would like to bring in Ferran Torres to our club. The Spanish international would fit Arsenal's style of play and the Premier League experience that he had with Manchester City would come in handy for us. The Spanish player is just 22 years of age and he is the kind of player that we are looking to bring into our club. Arsenal might go for this player towards the later part of this January transfer window. He has scored only 2 goals from 13 matches in this La Liga season, but he has scored 3 goals from 5 matches in the Champions League. The Champions League goals shows that the player has got the talent and it all comes down to whether Arsenal could cough up the money that's been asked for the player by Barcelona. We all know that Arsenal is in a great position in the league and as the Premier League resumes next week the games would come in thick and fast so for us to challenge a team like Manchester City who has got a great squad depth we would also need to bring in players to beef up our squad Ferran Torres fit the bill perfectly and if Arteta could bring in this player he could be played as a striker or as a winger we need to keep in mind that the world cup has been played within this season these international players who had played for the world cup will be asked to play for their club without much rest that's been required for them many experts believe that this heavy workload of these players would affect them towards the end of this season and there might be a situation where these players would be affected by injuries and we need to keep those in mind so for us to tackle this we need to be prepared with our squad and we need to bring in talented players to our squad in this January transfer window whether mikel atata is going to bring in these players and whether arsenal hierarchy is going to help him is what needs to be seen in the coming days and this brings us to another player who has been attracting quite a lot of attention in this transfer days and that is matheus kunha from another spanish club atletico madrid this is just another striker who is in his early 20s he is just 23 years of age and guess what he is a brazilian Arsenal already has a group of Brazilian players in our squad. Gabriel Magalhães, Gabriel Jesus, Gabriel Martinelli and Marquinhos. If Matheus Cunha is going to come to Arsenal, then uh, he will be the fifth Brazilian player in our squad. Atletico Madrid is not enjoying a great season in La Liga and he has been a second fiddle striker for them. If Arsenal director Edu, who himself is a Brazilian, is planning to bring in this striker to our club, then uh, he will be a backup for our striker Eddie Nketiah. Wolves were previously the front runners for signing this Brazilian forward. They have looked to do a double deal involving Matheus Cunha and Felipe, but they couldn't meet the financial demands of the La Liga side. Everton and Leeds United are also in the mix for this player. In fact, Aston Villa has also been reported as an interested party for this player. Atletico Madrid and Diego Simeone is known for their defensive style of game and this Brazilian forward is reported to be unhappy at the club due to the lack of playing time. He has been signed for the La Liga outfit in 2021 and has made only 54 appearances for the club. You might think that 54 is a fair number of games, but in reality he has started only 11 matches for the club and the rest 43 games he has played as a substitute. And due to this lack of playing time, the Brazilian striker was not selected for the World Cup squad.